So what happens next? The next few weeks will tell us whether 3i Atlas truly influenced the sun or if this was all cosmic coincidence. In early November, ESA's JUICE probe moves into position to observe the same region of space 3i Atlas just passed. It won't fly near it, but it can track changes in brightness and radiation that reveal whether the object is cooling, fragmenting, or still reacting to solar energy. By mid to late November, Earth-based telescopes will finally regain a clear line of sight. Astronomers will capture long exposures and stack data to see if 3i Atlas is surface fractured or released more gases after its close pass. Meanwhile, the sun itself will tell the rest of the story. If those same sunspot groups remain active as they rotate into view, it'll strengthen the idea of a possible solar resonance. If they fade, the alignment theory collapses. Either way, the next few weeks are a live experiment, watching how the sun responds with an interstellar traveler passes too close. 